All right, welcome back YouTube. A um, little bit different scenery, a little bit different of a start to my normal vlogs, um, and there's a reason behind that. I wanted to introduce you to my mini cup. So what I thought is I've got four weeks left um, before my final weigh-in for 15-week challenge, and I thought why not incorporate it into YouTube, especially now that I've just started. And a lot of my clients and a lot of people um, have even have even come up to me and said, you know, have you got any tips or tricks in trying to lose weight and doing this kind of thing? And I thought, what better platform to do it than on YouTube? So the clip you saw before um, was my official weight four weeks out from my weigh-in, which is a little bit higher than what I wanted, but perfect for this kind of series that I'm starting. So what the next next kind of video you'll see after this is a whiteboard session, and I'm explaining you three reasons why I think that was quite high for me. And then I go on to explain um, some tips and tricks that I do and I implement um, to try and drop off that weight that I don't want. So what I want you guys to do is come along with me, comment down below um, if you want to start this with me as well, and also just be relatable as well. Everything that I go through, you've probably gone through, um, and everything I'm going through, you might go through in weight losses as well. So anything you see in this vlog, feel free to use any tips and tricks. Shoot me down an email down below if you want any more guidance in terms of um, weight loss, diet plans, workout plans, anything like that, or just any questions, just comment down below. Find me on my social media sites. This is the beginning and this is my cut. Right, here we go, weight loss tips. Um, so the first one is diet. So in terms of diet, um, I'm talking about calories in versus calories out. So obviously if you eat more and don't expend more than that, then you're gonna put on weight. In terms of sleep, what I'm looking there is is trying to incorporate as, as much sleep as you possibly can depending on your work and environmental stages. Obviously, um, I've said in previous vlogs that I don't get optimal sleep, however I get enough sleep for my body. So you need to know what your body needs in terms of sleep and always get that. And finally, water intake. So a lot of people kind of disregard this and, and don't kind of have enough water. Remember, your body is made up of 70% water, so it needs water to survive. So if you don't have enough water, you'll become dehydrated. If you have too much water, you'll become bloated. So those kind of fluctuate in the, the weights readings as well. So I hope you guys picked up um, a few tips within this voice recording or voiceover um, in this whiteboard session. So yeah, excited to bring you this series and I'll catch you in the rest of the vlog. Much better way in. Good morning, YouTube. All right, what is up, YouTube? Good morning. Um, I'm on my way for my morning clients. It's about ten past seven. Um, and I'm working straight until about 11 a.m. So no breaks for me on this Saturday, which is quite good. Um, getting busier and busier on a Saturday, which is quite nice. Hopefully I'm going to again go and watch KB, um, KB play Mosgiel this time. Go watch the seconds boys because the first team is away in Invercargill. Um, but yeah, the plan is now go to my clients train women's expo at 12 to about two um, and then we'll see what happens there but yeah new low weigh-in for this mini cut if you could say that so yeah I, um, I can't remember the can't remember the reading but it is a it is a low low weigh-in which is really really good and this is why I had that big talk at the start of this video because you can't you can't get down or you can't get upset or you can't get annoyed um, at aspects in which are so variable that they should be annoyed annoyable at you know so you know I was a, I was a kilo heavier yesterday or nearly a kilo heavier yesterday um, and then I just restrained my calories I tightened up everything I was strict I was nice and I went out for dinner last night as well so that if that gives you something to um, kind of put into your head that you can go out and you still can lose weight you just have to be smart about it I didn't have too many carbs at dinner because I knew I was quite low on them um, because I had a little bit too much throughout the day. So I replaced, um, I, had a, I had a steak, um, but I replaced replaced the chips with the steak with just green veg. Um, and then I didn't, didn't have any alcohol or anything like that. So I um, was smart about my options in terms of eating and I just made sure that I wanted to start losing weight a little bit more every time so I was really really strict but yeah 
good low way and good start to a weekend. Um, time to go train some clients. I will see you in the next one. All right, clients done for a Saturday. Let's get to this expo. day one completed for me um, two or three hours just meeting some people and getting some sign-ups for my boot camp I gave away one icon MPT singlet as well which is cool um, did a wee Instagram giveaway um, but yeah now time to get some food haven't had a chance to eat uh, haven't had a chance to eat all day uh, so it's about what's the time what's the time 1 p.m. So it's 1 p.m. and I haven't had a meal, so positive I can have a little bit more calories. Um, but however, I'm quite hungry. However, it was really, really cool. This year has been awesome um, for me in terms of advertising and social media and stuff. So I had a few people come up and said they've seen my Facebook page, my Instagram, um, and some YouTube videos as well. So it's good that people are actually seeing it. I had a wee snippet before um, of what the expo is about, um, and I'll try and get more in the next footage tomorrow because I'm back on a Sunday. But yeah, it's been a really cool day. Um, awesome um, that someone won my MPT singlet and heaps and heaps of sign-ups for boot camp and heaps and heaps of giveaways for free personal training sessions as well. So if you've booked a personal training session or you've got a personal training session from the Women's Expo and you're watching this um, YouTube video, click down below um, on my website and book your session today. So yeah, plan is to get some food and I'm going to go watch a bit of football or a bit of rugby. Don't know which one I've decided yet. But yeah, that is the plan for now. I'll see you in the next one. Hi, welcome back to the vlogs. I'm off to watch some footy now. Tech v Queenstown, I think it is. Um, Cabby played yesterday actually, so I was wrong in the morning vlog. But thought I'd so show you what I'm wearing before I go out. So I'm wearing a huffer jersey, huffer jacket, some Adson ripped jeans, and I've got some NNDs in the car. But I'm late, so I'll switch to a driving vlog and. <laughs> All right, I hope you like that little transition that I did. Um, so yeah, most of the stuff that I do cleaning wise is just always on weekends, so nice and boring, but I thought I'd spice things up um, and make it a little bit more entertaining for the vlog. Yeah, so not doing a lot tonight. Um, I'm working longer tomorrow um, at the Women's Expo than I thought I was gonna work, so I just wanna do as little as possible um, and just relax. Might do some more eight week challenge programs and get them sent out for everyone. Um, so if you haven't received yours and you know who you are, Give me an email um, and I will sort you out as well. So yeah, doing minimal stuff tonight. I'm going to go watch rugby with someone um, and chill out with her for a little bit. So that will be fun. Other than that, um, yeah, not doing too much. Just relaxing, enjoying the weekend. Because next weekend is hectic because I'm leaving to go to Auckland on Thursday. Um, and then I come back Tuesday. So I want to spend and do as much as I possibly can in Auckland catch up with a few people and also see my parents. I haven't seen my parents for about a couple of months now so as you get older you kind of appreciate them a little bit more and the time you spend with them. So yeah, if I don't do anything else this is going to be the end of the vlog but if I do I will vlog it. So you'll find out. See you later. Alright, good morning YouTube. Welcome back to a Sunday. Um, I am just Jumping in my car, heading for my morning clients. 
<coughs> yeah, so heading for my morning clients. I have one or two this morning, um, and then I'm off to the expo. So yeah, like you just saw in the previous clip, a nice good weigh in again, so that's a new low for me. 83 kilo flat, which is good. So yeah, if you're wondering why I'm dropping so much so quickly, um, it's purely just at this stage of my diet when I tighten things up, and I tighten the calories up and all that kind of stuff, um, it's just water weight that I'm losing. So. I'm not losing, you know, too much fat at this point um, because my body fat's staying around about the same, um, and I feel like my tightness um, of my body and all that kind of stuff is getting there. So it's eventually going to drop, but at this point, my body is just getting rid of all that ex excess water and stuff like that. So when you go on a diet yourself, you'll notice that you'll do the first couple of weeks, two to three weeks, um, you'll drop incredible amounts of weight, um, which is really, really good. But the first couple of weeks of that you'll see a big change and that's because you'll drop a lot of water weight. Um, so yeah, plan is now, go to work, train a couple clients and then head to the Women's Expo again. I'm going to try and get some footage for you guys as much as I can, um, but I'll keep you up to date. See you later. up YouTube I am in the car up on a mission to find a MacBook charger I know that sounds weird but I forgot mine at work and the grind never stops for me I need to get programming done for this week coming for eight week challenge programs they need to get released tonight so I have to finish those off and email them and I can't wait for tomorrow but yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog I hope you guys enjoyed the women's expo footage and the mini series idea about the mini cut for me to go for the 15 week challenge I can't wait to bring you more content about weight loss and dieting and and kind of meal prepping and programming and working out because I think that's probably one of the biggest things that is the challenge for everyone when they're trying to make a weight loss change so yeah plenty of content coming this week especially Thursday and Friday's vlog in terms of the Auckland trip and then I'm coming back straight on the grind for the remaining weeks before the 15 week challenge ends but yeah hope you enjoy you guys night and I will see you in the next one Do you think we could find our